It's uh, it's on a Monday, March 25th, and uh, it's about 6:30. Um, we hunting a not a new piece to us, but a new piece for the year. This will be our first time hunting out here on this particular piece of property, and um, everything's good weather-wise. Finally, we got a pretty decent morning. It's crisp. It's cold, about 35 degrees. Um, looks to be fairly clear this morning. As of right now, I don't see any clouds, but um, hopefully we'll get on one. We're gonna kind of go to the middle of this property and just kind of listen. There's so many fields out here. We don't really want to take the chance of standing in one at daylight. So we'll get to the middle of the property and just kind of listen. And as soon as we hear one or whatever, we'll move and see what we can do. Um, like I said, finally got a decent weather day, but unfortunately can't hunt until about, I don't know, it's about what, 8.30? Something like that. Yeah. About an hour and a half, so gotta get to work. So we'll see what we can do. We're gonna kind of use this as a scout, and for tomorrow we're gonna we're gonna hunt out here tomorrow. Um, pretty much all day, it's about one or two o'clock, and the kind of the day we're gonna use is not we're not gonna be as aggressive today, but kind of just use today as a way to know where these turkeys are gonna be at. We got an idea, but these turkeys out here move around so much they they move their roost. I mean couple hundred yards every night so um just gonna kind of see what we can do and hopefully we can find a turkey that's willing to work with us and um hopefully get some redemption from this past weekend yeah we, we've been seeing a lot of people having a lot of success i mean season's been in what about three days today's the fourth day fourth day i mean it's still early and they're hard headed this time of the year you know i'd love to know the the keys to how some of these people are Having so much success early this season, other than maybe getting right up on them on the roost and not missing, well, not missing. But I mean, you know, you know how it goes, man. And turkey hunting nowadays, a lot of people ain't going about it completely the right way, and it's pretty unfair. But we're gonna stick to doing it the right way and doing what we're supposed to do to to make it fair chase and fair game, and you know, hunt these birds the way I feel like the Lord truly intended us to, and. We just got to stay persistent and stay committed to it and don't give up. And it's bound to start happening and rolling here pretty soon, hopefully. So, yep. well, Willie boy's on the gun this morning. I'm going to be filming. And if there's two, we'll try to pull a double, but it's their turn this morning. So, let's get out of this car and see what we can do. <clears throat> we just got to set up. At about nine o'clock, we leave to go to school and work and let these turkeys do their thing since they have their hens and they're not gonna move for the rest of the day. <clears throat> All right, so right now, um, it's about nine o'clock. We 
just got done uh, on a wheel and I'm by myself now. Um, just trying to ride around and find, you know, some signs, some turkeys. I mean, um, the property is where I'm at. I'm trying to just check and see where they're at, what they're doing. So what I'm doing is I'm just kind of, what I'm going to do is I'm going to hop from property to property, get out. Now who is still early enough to do it. It's about 9 o'clock, so, you know, they should be, should be plenty find us a shot dog at this time of day just kind of see where they're at going off the roost you know we're to put it bluntly we're struggling um but we told we said in our intro video when we started this channel that we wanted to to document um the highs and lows of turkey season and right now we're in a low you know we've missed a turkey or two turkeys really um and, and we, we've had a hard time i mean that's just the blunt reality of it so um we're, we're really trying to key in on hunting turkeys off the roost right now more than the afternoon because you know with, with the time of year and everything is you know the wind picks up in the afternoon and you know i mean sometimes they will lose their hands in the afternoon but um as of right now they're they're not in most places so right now we're just trying to key in on where they go on after they fly down what they're doing what direction they're heading that sort of thing so um just gonna keep looking so right now i'm just scouting pretty hard trying to find a, a good turkey to hunt this afternoon roxy's probably gonna go with me my girlfriend and then um i said we're also gonna be starting to kind of scout for tomorrow morning so um hope that we'll we'll find some turkeys and better get on them so we're working hard struggle right now but we're gonna we're gonna get us we're gonna get it right all right, it's uh, it's 12 o'clock and about to go, about to go see what we can do, about to go try it. Um, got Roxy with me, so um, we can see what we can do. Like I said, she's she's been a handful of times. She's had a couple come in front of her, but didn't pan out. But this is the first time she's been able to go this year, so we're gonna go try it for two or three hours. And on the place we're going, it's got a lot of water, so I'm not sure that they're gonna be where they're where they were last year but we're gonna try and see it ain't gonna kill nothing to hurt so or to try it ain't gonna hurt nothing to try so we're gonna uh we're gonna get out there and see what we can do For the next couple hours, we go from property to property trying to strike a turkey with no success. So that's gonna do it for this one. Um, actually, the last time we talked to you, I think would have been uh, would have been yesterday. I don't even think we got much footage yesterday. Um, today is Wednesday, uh, March twenty seventh, and um, to put it bluntly, it's just been been a rough week. I mean, Monday we got on some turkeys on the roost, and they pitched down, we got with hens, and didn't make a sound. And then yesterday, man, we struggled to find a turkey, to be honest with you. I don't even think we we got on turkey all day. We went three or four different, different little pieces of property. And it's just been rough, man, to start off the year. Me and Will both have been struggling. And, um, you know, we're really not sure why. We don't think we're doing much wrong. We're not really spooking any turkeys that we know of. Um, it's just unfortunate. It's just, you know, kind of started off the year. Uh with the jake or whatever and then um you know i missed that turkey opening day but 
other than that, it's been very, very scarce as far as action goes. But, you know, it's part of turkey hunting and something you can't control. And one thing you can't control is the weather. And uh, today's Wednesday and it's been raining uh, pretty much all day. And it's supposed to continue raining tomorrow pretty much all day. Maybe a little break in the afternoon. But I won't be able to go tomorrow. But Friday, Saturday, and Sunday is supposed to be pretty again. So, um, you know, this week we're celebrating the Holy Week. And then we, you know, celebrate Good Friday, this coming Friday, and Easter Sunday. So, um, no better time to be in the woods than now um, celebrating the, the, the resurrection of our Lord and Savior. So, um, hopefully we, we have some luck. It's, it's been a rough start to the year, but a long way to go, or a long way to go, and a long way to to uh, to find a turkey. A long, long time to get on one. So, um, you know, South Carolina ain't no joke. We talk about, you know, we're not throwing shade to any guys in other states, but we've always heard Alabama, Mississippi, and Georgia. You know, has been you know their hardest hardest states to kill a turkey in, and that's certainly true. I would have to imagine, but. You know, I don't think South Carolina gets the credit that it deserves. Man, it's, it's a difficult state to turkey hunt. I think, if I'm not mistaken, I think South Carolina out of, the, out of Mississippi, uh, Georgia, and Alabama has the least uh, amount of turkey population. Uh, what I've read, I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure. So, I mean, it, it's no it's no slouch. It's no go in the woods and kill a turkey type of state. It's, it's a very hard place to hunt. And, uh, you know, again, not throwing shade, but I wish it would get the credit that it deserves because it's a very difficult state to, to hunt turkeys. And, um, you know, like I said, we're going to keep after them. We're discouraged. We, you know, we're seeing a lot of buddies, a lot of friends, a lot of, you know, a lot of social media and about, you know, people killing turkeys. And and granted, we did have that opportunity to open in the morning that I missed, but, you know, it's part of turkey hunting. We're down, we're discouraged, but I told Will yesterday, we're going we're gonna to wipe the slate clean uh and we're gonna hit hit the first of april full speed uh the end of march and take it into april and and get after it keep it out keep, keep after him full speed and um you know keep positive you can't you can't get down turkey hunting you'll never you'll never kill one and it'll drive you nuts so uh hate hate this was a short video with very little footage but we did want to kind of document our whole season with the highs and the lows of turkey hunting and right now we're at the lowest of lows uh hopefully at some point we'll get to a high um I got a feeling it's going to come at some point. I mean, it, you can't go all year without having another chance. But fingers crossed, next time we see y'all, we'll we'll have a turkey fanned out and uh, we'll get y'all some good footage. But like I said, hate it. But, you know, this is a part of turkey hunting just as much as killing one. This is more of a part of turkey hunting than killing one. So hope y'all enjoyed this shorter video. Hope y'all enjoyed uh, kind of just going through our days and talking about what we're trying to do to find turkeys and that sort of thing. And, um, you know, it'll shift at some point. We 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 believe that firmly. We have our fingers crossed, and good Lord willed, and the creek don't rise, we'll we'll finally get us a turkey. So, hope y'all enjoyed, and uh, we'll catch y'all on the next one.